Hi everyone, welcome back. Okay, today we are going to do a new project, uh, cucumber. Yeah, this was actually adopted or born at germinated at this 8th of August. Until now, today is 27 August, and it will be 19 days old now. And I adopted them on the seven or eight day, yeah. And they was in a small container lah. Then today, I just give them their own individual apartment. Okay. So I'm going to try. Okay, one will be outdoor for my plot. One over here will be at my corridor and one more over here as in corridor yes but then would be in a proper pot and maybe this fella i will leave it over here meaning one of these three i will contain into a very small container like this forever yeah so we will see whether they will produce uh, at least one melon or one cucumber within these two months so if everything soon soon okay should be we might have one over here and this fella one of these sisters which i would not want to uh, give them a bigger um, pot so we will see and one of them will be a micro light over here so we will see whether they will give me at least one cucumber <laughs> okay let's look forward <laughs> so i have transplanted them and inside is apart from compost i also add in bone meal yeah to supplement their calcium meat because they are climber meaning their stem over here should be thicker so when they are matured, uh, they will be able to handle their own fruits. Also, meanwhile, yeah, I just add, uh, I think 50-50, yeah, so plus minus there, doesn't matter. Anyway, they are composed, they are organic matter, yeah, so we will just observe. Okay, so I will update you on the next week and see how they are grow. Yeah, for this tree, I will just put them into this uh, hydrolyte. This is annoying because why? Every morning when uh, the light is on, okay, the pump inside and the fan will run, and because there is no water inside, my right is a hydro set. There's no water inside. So they will give me a very loud sound. It's annoying. Yeah, so every morning I have to open my door and come out and manually turn off. You can see? Noisy, right? Yeah. So, you know, I only need the light only. Yeah, so we will see how it goes next week. <laughs> uh, so for time being, I will treat them as vegetable. So I'll give them a vegetable light first. Mm. Okay. The house is a bit too too tall, too low for them. Okay, wait ah, huh? I need to adjust this fella higher. Okay, I'm done. I have just adjusted the height and I'll put it in. Yeah, let them rest for a while before I give them water. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> okay, so let's play along the light. This is this is flower and fruit light. And this is the light. Vegetable. You can see a difference. Flower, vegetable. Yeah, so for the time being I'll treat it as vegetable because the true leaf is just out only. So they will have their vegetable light. Uh, yeah, until maybe I see four 
meaning two set of true leaf and until this fella this is the seeding leaf so for time being I don't need to put in any fertilizer because the seeding leaf will self fertilize themselves so until the seeding leaf dies off dry then that is where we can uh, fertilize them every week until the fruit and until the last of the life okay now I think they are quite okay so we will add in water this was grown in a uh, germination um, uh, tray yeah so okay, okay, yeah. I put it back there Yeah, so this was grown in the germination tree before I adopt them and yeah, so their root is quite compact so by adding more soil, meaning their root, they can stretch out to have more nutrients for them and I think because of the bone meal I attract quite a few flies over here but it doesn't matter okay let them rest for a while it will take some time for the entire um, soil to wet by osmosis progress I think Yeah, so remember this, we try to avoid watering the leaf. Or oh, especially at the noon time. Because, okay, uh, indoor we, we are doing hydro, we, we are doing the grow light quite okay. But let's say if we are outdoor, you uh, water their leaf okay you might get a leaf burn because water on the leaf and heat by the sunlight means the water dew magnifying the heat or they boil very fast and therefore you will see your your fruit your vegetable or your leaf get heat burn then it will not be good already then they will start to attract pests because heat burn means uh, injured yeah so not that good lah. okay yeah okay. okay so I'll leave it over here for one more week until next Sunday we will see how long it progress so perhaps um, I don't know maybe you guys can advise should I because this roof I can extend until maybe about one meter so should I wait until they are one meter and more stable and more leaf before I transplant them or I just transplant them next week leave a comment below and remember to share to like okay and to follow me for future progress and project I mean so yeah that's all for now have a good weekend thank you take care stay safe goodbye